The woman accused of killing three people while allegedly driving under the influence in Lexington was back in court today for a preliminary hearing. Michael Burke spoke with the victim's relatives after a judge granted Tammy Rodriguez's defense a continuance to undergo a psychological test. That's the LEX 18 Big Story at 530. Zach Webb struggles these days with simply getting out of bed. I feel like there's really no life in me, to be honest with you. Early last month, he lost his fiance, Caitlin Bailey, in the wreck that killed two others, including Caitlin's sister, Taylor. Police say Tammy Rodriguez took them on a chase, which ended when she slammed into two cars while driving in the wrong direction on I-75 near the Southern Split. Today, Rodriguez appeared in court on DUI and murder charges, but a continuance was granted to conduct a psych evaluation. Rodriguez has four prior DUI convictions. But I think she's sane. I think she knew what she was doing when she got drunk and high and got in the car and ran into my children. We figured something like this would happen. They would just want to push it back to try and draw up something to not give her you know, the punishment that I think that she deserves. Precisely what the mother who lost two daughters in this wreck is thinking about this psychological evaluation. I'm worried about that she's going to get away with murdering my kids. It's already destroyed the future Mr. Webb had been planning. That was my best friend. It was my fiance and now the big part of my life is, is gone. Rodriguez, whose sister Debbie was also killed in the crash, will be back in court November 5th. In Lexington, Michael Burke, LEX 18 News. Bailey says this tragedy has brought the entire family closer together and now more than ever they don't take spending time together for granted.